Hello, welcome to Short of Sir classes. So this question is from ISI M Math. Two thousand twenty two from the paper, and this solution has been prepared by the faculty of short observer classes. So, question number seven consider the following vector spaces over R. We have V and W, even this closed interval 0, 0,1, and in the real space where F is a continuous function, and for the case of W, F is a function, and if is T is a map, where is V is mapping over W is the map defined by T of F T then which of the following statements is not true so you have to find the incorrect option so let's start with this so we have this v given as f in the closed interval 0 comma 1 which is in the real space r so f is a continuous function and we have w is in the closed interval 0 comma 1 in the real space r where f is a function so and t is the map where v is mapping to w so t of f t TFT this is T of FT which will be an element of V as F is continuous right so this is if this T of F is continuous similarly T of FT will also be continuous right so t is a this t of v will be a subset of v which is a correct option so we have to find the incorrect one next is option b t is a linear map from v to v so this is the option a that is the correct option uh, this is a correct statement so we have to find whether t is a linear map from v to v so we have t of alpha f plus g t equal to small t alpha f alpha f plus g of t so we can simplify it further as alpha r t of f t plus t dot g t. So this is equal to nothing but so alpha t we can write it as from this equation we know that t of f t is nothing but t of a f. can write t of f t plus t of you can write in a similar manner t of g t so from here we can infer that t is linear so this is also a correct option so to find c that where t is, uh, t is injective uh, so t is 1 to 1 so if we have this t of f equal to 0 then we have t f of t equal to 0 for all t in the belongs to the closed interval 0 comma 1 right so from here we can get that t of ft equal to 0 comma 1 
equal to 0 for all t in the closed interval 0 comma 1 from here we can write that f of t equal to 0 for all t in the closed interval 0 comma 1 so f is also equal to 0 so here t is injected that is t is on 1 to 1 now the final option we have to find that d is t of v equal to v so if you take that f of t is equal to 1 so here for all t in the interval 0 comma 1 and if t of g is equal to f okay so that implies that uh, t of g t equal to f of t f of t means so t of gt is equal to 1 now if we put t equal to 0 so then which will have this 0 is equal to 1 over here so we have this 0 over here so f of t is only equal to 1 so here we can see so which is uh, not possible in this case so f of t is only 1 if it is not a member of tv so if f of t is not a member of tv so we can infer that t of v is not equal to v so this is the incorrect option so you have to find which of the following statements is true in question number 7 so the incorrect option is uh, d Question number 8, for positive integers r and n with r less than n, let p denote the n by n matrix. So, matrix is given over here. And where 0, k cross L is the, it's the 0 matrix with the k rows and L columns. And h, t denote the transpose of the matrix h. And we have been given this v equal to, where h is a, belongs to this m n by n matrix in the real space. h is equal to h p plus p h h equal to h p plus p of h which is nothing but the h transpose so we have to find which of the following option is true so if we have this h is equal to h of i j then p of h will be h of 1 1 h of 1 2 h of 1 3 up to we will h of 1 n right next it will be h of 2 1 h of 2 2 h of 2 3 so it will go like this to h of n and just erase this it is h of 1 1 so after we have this h of r1 h of r2 and h of r3 h of rn and it will be the 0 So this will be the matrix for pH. And what will be the matrix for HP? HP will be if you write at H of T, that is H transpose and P transpose. So as both H and P are self adjoint, self adjoint matrix. So we can write it as pH of T, that is a pH transpose so simply we will just transpose this pH matrix 
so which will be so the first uh, row will be h11 h21 then it will go to h of r1 and we have the 0 over here then h of 1 2 h22 h of r2 0 and it is going uh, so h of 1 n so similarly the h of 2 n right and h of r n so we will have this 0 over here so this will be the ph transpose So now put into the equation H equal to PH plus HP. So which is, so if we write this H is equal to this H of 1, 1, H of 1, 2 to H of 1, N. then equal to H of 2, 1, H of 2, 2 up to H of 2, N. write it as h of n1 h of n1 h of n2 h of n equal to this matrix so if we just plus of these two matrix ph plus hp so it will be 2 of H11, 2 of H12 minus two of H12. So all will be plus. So this of two of H11, two of H22. So it will go up to two of H1R. So 2 of H1R, then 2 of H, so we will have this, let, let's see here, so we have this two matrix P of H and H of P, so we will have this 2 H1, 2, A, 2 of H1, 2, 2 of H1, but, uh, so this matrix will, uh, this 2 of H2, 1, 2 of H22 up to 2 of H2R okay. and here it will be H of R plus 1 up to H of 1N H of 2R plus 1 so this is 1R plus 1 2R plus 1 up to H of 2N Similarly, we will go in this side and it will be 2 of HR1, 2 of HR2, 2 of HRR, H of RR plus 1 and it will be H of RN and the remaining of the matrix will be remaining of the matrix just uh, it is this part so the remaining of the matrix will be it will be h of at r plus 1 comma 1 it will go up to h of r plus 1 comma r and it will go to h of n 1 to h of n comma r and here it will be the whatever the zero matrix you can see that this zero matrix n minus r n minus r column and n minus r rows so this will be the ph plus hp okay so there this h of ij is equal to zero for all ij in the interval one less than equal to r so this is the interval 
now what will be h let's find the h now so our h will be this putting this h of ij equal to 0 so it will be 0 r cross r this is a a and 0 n minus r this n minus r column by n minus r rows so what is a this a is h of 1r plus 1 h of 1n and it is hr r plus 1 h of r comma n so this is the a so what will be the dimension of v is n minus r square okay. so let's check with the option so this of the following statement to find the truth so it is option b so option b is the correct answer